Outlook integration. Integration between CRM and Outlook is hugely useful as a feature because from a customer service perspective, it means that I have a more complete picture of the total conversation being had between customers and companies. And from a user salesperson perspective, it means I have no obligation to leave the system I'm most comfortable in to track those activities. So essentially, we're asking people to do something that they were going to do anyway to give the customer a better experience. Dashboards. Dashboards are a new feature in CRM 2011, and essentially they give users and administrators alike the ability to visually represent their living, breathing data in a real-time format from within the system. What's more is that it gives the user the ability to use a slicer tool to deep dive into their data for purposes of data mining or personal business intelligence. Having the ability to look at your data in this way not only helps to keep you organized, but it can give you insight into patterns that may be occurring or could be anticipated, such as certain types of support cases that could be requested at the same time every year, or maybe in proximity to one another, which could help in problem solving. Working Tasks and Opportunities Knowledge working, knowledge management inside of Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 has never been easier since the flexible design of the system allows businesses to manage their sales pipeline by tracking through opportunity, proposal or quote, order, and invoice stages. As tasks may pertain to specific sales stages, they can be assigned to appropriate people, and these tasks will automatically sync down to their Outlook client as well as track against the opportunity regardless of the sales stage it may be in. In this way, people who might be charged with managing an opportunity can delegate things that need to be done and notified if something doesn't occur on schedule. For example, many opportunities begin with an RFP or a request for proposal. Oftentimes, salespeople will have to sign a letter of acknowledgement or an intent to respond, and this can be delegated to a marketing person. This task feature in CRM ensures that everyone works in concert with one another. Goal management. Goal management in CRM 2011 allows managers to put visible, tangible goals in front of their salespeople, customer service representatives, or other users of CRM in terms of activity counts, revenue, and other activities as they may pertain to CRM. This helps businesses have a top-down look at the inner workings of their organization and workers to have a bottom-up, transparent view into not only their goals and what's expected of them, but, if the law allows, into the goals of anyone in the organization. This can give anyone who needs it a finger on the pulse of the company's activities. Didn't hit the F3.5 numbers? Well, our sales rep call rate was down in September. Managers aren't doing enough to ensure their reps have enough new leads to call in order to drive the activity level that's required to hit the goals.